The brand new Boeing 777 has several new technologies and also unique features that have never been seen before in the aviation commercial industry. However, as with any significant update to an aircraft program, the respective aircraft manufacturer behind the plane needs to ensure that enough improvements to justify the production cost and the ability to attract customers globally is there. One of the most intriguing features on the 777X is the never seen before folding wingtips on a commercial airliner. We've only seen this feature on military planes and now seeing it on a commercial plane has surprised the general public, especially with the aircraft yet to fly with passengers, meaning our views of this ingenious device have been limited. Let's dive into why Boeing added folding wingtips to its famous 777 series. First, we must look into the 777X features. The 777X is Boeing's most unique twin aisle aeroplane, based on now the famous aging 777 series. The fact we have to say this series is aging can certainly make one feel old. The 777X, however, is using new technologies from the 787 and the Boeing Eco Demonstrator. In addition, it uses composite materials for its massive wing. Composite materials has been fundamental to many future aircraft and, of course, aircraft as part of this next generation. The wingspan of the 777X stretches 71.75 meters. In comparison, the famous A380, which is the world's largest commercial airplane in service, has a wingspan of 79.80 meters. That's a difference of some 8 meters in total to the most significant commercial aircraft. The older Boeing 777-200 and Dash 300 already had a large wingspan that did limit the airports it may have potentially been able to fly into. The older variants of the 777 had a wingspan of only 64.8 meters. With the new 777X advancements and its very large size being the longest aircraft in the world, 76.72 meters, that is a very incremental increase on the current longest plane, the 747-8. Now, with the 777X being much longer, the aircraft needed also longer wings for better fuel efficiency and a lower CO2 emission rate. Because of the large length of the wings and its effect on continuing to fly to the same airports as the older 777, Boeing had to rethink a way of fixing this especially for fitting it into gates around the world. The last thing the American aircraft manufacturer would have wanted is airports having to greatly adjust their infrastructure once more to make way for the addition of the 777X. This is something similar we saw with the Airbus A380 that potentially deterred airlines from ordering the aircraft, among many other reasons. To fix this, Boeing decided to have the end tips of the 777X wing foldable, meaning it could go from 71.25 meters to 64.8. The extra 3.36 meters on each wingtip allows the 777X to be surprisingly efficient for its large size, being 10% more fuel efficient and seeing 10% lower operating costs than its competition. This allows the new aircraft to fly to the same airports as the older 777s without disrupting operations at the airports or limiting the new aircraft. In addition, it enables the airlines to operate the massive 777X like the Boeing 777, which can be very important for airlines looking to update their fleet network and have a staggered entry and also retirement of the respective airliners. Do you think this new feature is something we will see more in the future with newer planes, especially for potentially any larger aircraft that will come? Or is the future headed elsewhere and will this stay uniquely on the 777X only? You can let us know your thoughts down below in the comments. Thank you very much for watching. We hope you are enjoying the beginning of 2023 and we will see you next time.